what is going on boys and girls of youtube today is patch day because it's patch day you just hit the like button make sure you subscribe because if you're not you're trolling but it is patch day zeus got a rework so i want to play some zeus and i'm actually gonna take zeus in the jungle if you guys ever played smite back in the day zeus is three when you proc'd it used to stun people during that time zeus was actually played in the jungle a ridiculous amount now that's not what high res brought back to us they buffed the two instead which is still exciting for a similar reason because it gives us mobility in a way we're faster we can rotate around the map we can do all that stuff our clear is a little bit better and our sustained fight is a little bit better hey everyone make sure you are voting for me for the golden bolts you have until the 22nd i believe of november to get those votes in you will go to goldenbolts.smitegame.com you will log in using your smite login like what you would log in to play the game then you will hit the vote button and you can vote for me for streamer of the year and you can vote for me for clip of the year i will see you all in the video now pair the fact that your sustained fight is a little bit better with the other fact that you can go this book of the dead build right book of the dead build has crazy high survivability which makes it really exciting so we're gonna try to get away with it in the jungle i haven't done anything like this in a while I think it's definitely gonna be possible but be very hard because every team comp these days is just a ton of dive gods which is really really difficult to play into um actually i'm gonna be super greedy here too i'm gonna go beads i want to go blink as well uh i want to be able to counter engage if i play it properly but yeah it's gonna be really hard to play around a loki comp a gilgamesh comp and if and it's a lot like they just have crazy good dive tm like, i don't even know what their team comp is i don't know who their adc is i don't know who anyone on their team comp is we'll see what we can get out of it uh but i do still start with the one because i think the one is still just gonna be better jungle clear and then usually level the two to help with wave and then max the three i'll be maxing the three first and playing this similar to you know just a normal old mage uh clear is pretty good honestly but yeah you'll play it similar to a to normal mage build where you're going for heavy burst damage and uh, just having more survivability because we're going to go Breastplate of Valor. We're going to go Book of the Dead. We're going to go Book of Thoth. All the mana items. All of them. And if they happen to build crit, you can fit a Spectral into the build. But you will do way less damage. You'll just be crazy tanky. Which isn't a bad thing. Where is this guy? Ah, uh, he went for cringe gank. Like where, no, I didn't know people still did cringe ganks at this point in the game. <laughs> I don't know. Dude, people, seeing people do that is so troll. That sucks. Just one ward counters that. Thanks a little boost towards my uh, my jungle camps here, buddy. Might be able to kill the duo then. Be nice. Come on, buddy. Power clear, power clear, power clear. My early gank isn't the best, but it's not bad. Just a little risky walking into them like this with no mobility. Yep, they're on those, which is fine. Gank. Maybe my one here. That's really good. Somehow the Sylvanas got the kill, which is crazy. You are oh, no shot. Oh, I my three. No, we didn't get him in time. Oh my gosh. If I had to hit three a second earlier, that would have been sick. It's unfortunate. Very unfortunate. Also, my guy didn't have his stun up, which sucks for it. Like that was just so close to being a perfect, uh, perfect double kill for us. Woo, super close. Sucks our Sylvanas took the kill. Would have really liked to have an early kill on Zeus. It's going to happen though. Please don't die on mid. You're Discordia. You, you're pretty much unkillable, right? Yeah. There you go, buddy. Retreat right. You see the Loki? You see the Loki? You see the Loki? I don't know why Loki's going for an early gank. It's gonna push his camps back a little bit here. I'm hoping this guy waits. Wait. Waits for me on blue. If he doesn't wait for me on blue, he's actually trolling me. Thanks. Shove, dude. So they have a Gilgamesh. Kind of a hard gank overall. Uh he has no defense though. Did he not see me? That was really weird. Oh, I want the kill, man. I'm trying so hard. So Loki wasn't right. We should have enough time to get this. Get where there is should. If Mulan's with me, I shouldn't die. Yeah, we're good. Get him a nice little blue invade. I'm going to leech one more wave from him because he got the kill. 
didn't get the kill, I probably would have dipped. <sighs> but we'll be good. He'll be okay. It's a lot of farm to get still. We have our ult up too, which is our self peel. Grab all our neutral farm along the way. We're ahead of Loki right now until he gets, I think, speed and then mid wave should hit him, get him five. So he's not too far behind me. We are ahead though. And if we can get ahead to the point where we get a breastplate online before we start dying, oh, it's going to be glorious, dude. It's going to be amazing. Might even be able to go for another gank on this Gilgamesh. He's just so squishy and he's being aggro. He's got a breastplate too, so he's no magic defense. Um. Nice. I'm gonna take away from him as well and so normally I wouldn't take away but it's gonna take him a while to get back to this uh to the lane he doesn't have tp because he shouldn't have tp and I want to make sure that the Gilgamesh misses the wave if I don't push this in the Gilgamesh is probably not gonna oh okay oh the kid yes the body blocks oh the creeps body blocked him Loki alt down Glorious gamers, glorious. I'm surprised the Loki came over. I, I like really didn't expect him to be over there. I'll take it. Ended up working out. Beads ended up being our savior. Uh, Aegis would have been nice in general, but being able to just move right away and cause he caused him to get body blocked by all the creeps. <laughs> and he's a little slow. I think. Oh no, he wasn't. All I did was all. I'm trolling. I just got super lucky that he got body blocked by creeps. We have a fatty lead now, and we may be able to go. No, oh, okay, fatty lead gone because he decided to get picked. Uh, we may be able to go over there blue though, which would be nice. I don't know if he knows the timer on it. Oh, he has no idea, dude. We go for blue. Really good play. This dude is getting clapped, dude. Oh my gosh. Your ability to kill uh, solo laners is... Pretty, pretty high. <laughs> it's really high. Oh my goodness. I want to level the two for the movement speed. But at the same time, I think leveling the one is just still way better. I really, when you go mage build like this, you go an attack speed build. If you go like the Oleron esque build, I don't think uh, obviously leveling it would be better. But leveling the two in this situation wouldn't be the move. I might be able to play them out here. I, I know so yeah, 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 yeah. Oh no, I cut him off and it didn't work. Oh that was a sick play. That was a sick play. I can't believe he just walked away from that. That's unfortunate. I put my ult to cut him off. I should have just played it for damage. No, and now everyone's dying. Please. Whoa, he's super far behind. Oh my gosh, he doesn't even have his first item. That sucks. All right, well, we'll go start our breastplate. Misplay. A little bit of a misplay there. Uh, where's breastplate? There it is. Got our breastplate started. My hold, they're so low. That was a really, oh, nice. Glad he got a kill. That was, it was a good play from Vulcan. I think there's a little bit of luck involved there with uh, with everything, but you know, that was sick. He knocked me into his all if you didn't see it. He knocked me right into that thing. Man, that caught them up a lot. Actually, they're ahead of us. They're way far ahead of us than they shouldn't be. There's no world where they should be ahead of us right now. We're trying to clear fast so he gets that blue buff. So my dude heals a little bit. Um, he's looking for me here. He knows we're here. Unfortunate. I do still think this is a good gank. Oh, please. Nice. I got one kill. That should be a double. If he has any abilities up, he hit the pool. That was sick. Oh, I think he, he beats it. Yeah, look, he beats it. Nice. All right. Well, we're okay. We didn't get the blue, which sucks, but we got even more pressure on the side of the map. Fortunately, Loki leaves. We don't want that. We want him to be the one dying there if possible, uh, just so we can stop him from farming. Dang, my mid is two levels down. He's got Kronos spending online finally. Goodness gracious. He needs to up his farm. I think it's because he's not leaving the mid lane. Guys, you have to realize 
if you're super shook or scared while sitting in lane you can pass safely so first of all you don't die like you can li he can literally walk behind his tier one tower and go into the jungle right like there's no world where in the early game he's gonna get killed nowadays now where he's super far behind maybe maybe he dies um but in general it's usually not gonna die you can't just sit in your lane if smite is not played like that you cannot just sit there you will lose every game where all you do is sit in your lane it's just not gonna work out you have to rotate you have to go for farm you have to you know make the game uh happen it doesn't it'll come to you you don't have to force anything but you need to make the game happen can't literally stand there afk some farm get some new farm i don't actually want to go for the next blue i'm just going to go split with him on the blue buff uh he's going for hydra so he doesn't even do that much damage right now his build's kind of bad for the early game quick secure that and like i said we're gonna avoid most of the solo lane fights now he's dead and right again oh not again that's his first death we don't want him to die oh he needs help he got ulted poor guy slack of rotations Yo, gank. come on we see him you see him Loki's here he missed he doesn't do any damage to me either. An enemy has been Double beads. I might kill him here with two. Nice pull, dude. He was dead anyway. Uh, so the breast play right there kept me alive, like fully. He also ulted a little late. They tried to pair it with the Vulcan, which would have been a nasty combo. I'm not going to lie to you. Just a little late, a little slow. Difficult to do sometimes. Um, it is. Respect them walking with me. And the heels. What a god. <laughs> Need to help him over here. <laughs> Oh, I messed up this play. I can't land an auto right now either. Got him. It's not even a I want everyone to back out. I feel pretty comfortable and safe right now. So I'm trying to make sure my teammates survive. I'm going to go get my neutral farm because I know the Loki's going to want to be looking for it because he has nothing else to do. He is pretty far. This whole side of the map is pretty far behind. We need to help right. Goal right now is helping right. Yeah, they're probably invading your red buff, but it is what it is. Losing one red buff for all that pressure we just gained and the lead we got back, definitely worth. Loki's uh, farming that lane, which is smart. He doesn't want to fall too far behind. Like I said, there isn't much else for him to do. So I'm going and getting those waves is really smart. I think my Mulan could have killed him if uh, he wanted to be more aggressive. And now we're going to start building towards our Book of the Dead, which is going to be solid. I said I wanted to go blink, but I think Aegis is like a must in this situation. And the reason for that being is they just have so much dive and they're being aggressive that I can't do too much. He's getting clapped now in the 1v1. By a Tiamat too, which I'm surprised by. The Tiamat is really squishy. Even when he goes into his melee form, like he has no sustain. He's a very, very squishy boy compared to my Ho Yi. I think my hoe, you must be missing abilities. Got a crit build too. I think they're doing gold. Yep. Enemy I might have walked over a ward. That. I need a run though. I'm so tanky in the shell. Oh, he's at one health. Please kill him. Nice. Good. That was such a good Vulcan ult. Juke shoes. Juke shoes, baby. That was actually a really well placed Vulcan ult. I'm not going to lie to you guys. My Sylvanas is healing like a champion. Like, actually, he's using his heals and everything so well. That dude felt like he was tanky right there. That was weird. Just because I don't have pen. So we'll go into the Book of the Dead. We will then go into the ob shard if we're really far ahead or they aren't building any defense or we feel like we don't need the pen right away uh we can go into soul reaver early but it's ob shard soul reaver are pretty much our last items now if you need to go extra tanky 
because they're building crit or you're just getting clapped or like i don't know you just need to survive whatever it is you can build a spectral armor instead of the soul reaver that will give you mana it'll give you a ton of defense and if they're going crit it'll help you survive through that crit <clears throat> i don't know if a fail not build is going to become a meta build at all but fail not got buffed recently so and spectral got nerfed still really good item it just got barely nerfed slightly nerfed uh, so I'm wondering how much more we'll see crit like <laughs> I'm kind of unsure uh, If it's gonna be a lot if it's gonna be less if it's gonna be different builds. I really just don't know what we're gonna see Your right tower. One of the wave to him That's bad. Right tower is under okay, I want to try to kill ho lane and then go for gold Dang, just having your purple invaded on cooldown Kind of awkward, buddy. By a Tiamat, nonetheless. I should just die. They're warding a lot. I don't have active, so Loki ults me here. I'm probably dead. Oh my god. What a beast! Beautiful ult for my Sylvanas, dude. Oh my goodness, this Loki's tilted. This Loki can't kill me right now. Oh, and he's building crit. The Loki can't kill me right now because he doesn't have any pen. Uh, he has zero, zero pen build, which I see way too often. Like, like, yes, I have zero pen, but I'm a mage. I'm gonna do consistent damage. Uh, and my burst is still gonna be there. It's just not gonna be as potent. And I'm about to build pen, and I'm ahead of him. You can't do this. He should have a brawlers. He should have any really. There's a lot of things. He's nice Let's go. Nice job boys. Slow key's really really trolling. <laughs> Honestly, I would not be happy, bro yeah, This should be a free gold Yep, free gold. Nice job Beautiful plays for my Sylvanas. Like his awareness to sit with me without me actually being able to communicate to him. <laughs> God tier. Actual God tier. Because I told, I even said, I'm like, Loki's probably going to open on me and he's going to kill me. I live a one health. Breastplate kept me alive. The Book of the Dead now will definitely keep me alive. I will be a living boy here with the Book of the Dead. I really like this build. Wait till you see the Book of the Dead proc. Like the shield you get off of this is ridiculous. It's ridiculous. I mean, you're getting a shield for, I think I'm getting 750 health shield when it procs right now. Uh, and I'm not even full build yet. It's wild. If there was another item you could get with penetration and mana, uh, that would be really like the kicker. I guess you could go warlocks instead of the ob shard. You definitely would live then. Let me tell you, you would, you would be surviving, man. You would just be losing out on 10% pen plus the initial pen. So I don't really know how much better that would be. But the survivability though. We might go it. We might end up going it. I don't know. Yeah, really just a super expensive build. I think that's probably the, the, the biggest downside to it. It would take forever to get the stacks up and just be very, very expensive. This guy seems to have a lot of wards. Everybody sees me. Okay, he doesn't have a ward there, which is good. I wish I had blink. I mean, I don't because the Aegis have kept me alive, but I wish I had blink in general. Oh, I misplayed. Whoops. There's that book that pop. Oh my gosh, I got Sylvanas ulted too. I'm dead to the dots. Or am I not? I'm not. Nice job. Oh my gosh, Vulcan ult, Tiamat leap, Tiamat ult. Oh, the Sylvanas ults, the mannequins. Woo, that was a lot. That was a lie. We're gonna go for the op shard now. Uh, we're gonna get a counter ward as well. So we can set up for the fire with the team. Got gold coming up. I hope they live. That ADC is just so low. That shield is nuts, man. That shield is insane. Uh, they're gonna die here. They overcommitted. Good try. 
I think Koji's trying to, to, to stay in, which is actually not bad. I'm here now, so we might be able to defend a little bit. Oh, I missed. I'm trolling. You can defend though. Nice. Oh, huge. It is rude. That would have been really massive. I'm huge. Oh my god. Oh! Oh! No! His ult came back up. I'm so sad, dude. He full committed that whole thing. Wait, he's a Warriors? He went tanky. Interesting. If this OE plays the game, he gets killed. If he doesn't play the game, he's not going to get a kill. He's kind of missing and not really playing the game. He's actually getting... So he's doing some weird stuff. I don't know what he's doing, but it's weird. That damage I was just doing just off autos was crazy with no attack speed. That was wild. Hopefully we can group up, get some wards. Wards. Just gotta watch out for fire pool. Gold's up semi soon. Buffs are all up. So there's a lot of neutral farm to get. I want to hit level 20 and try to get the... Uh, realistically with this build, you want to go into a pendulum instead of the Bumbas, but I really feel like Bumbas is a necessity in a game like this so i'm actually going to go into the bumba's hammer which might seem weird but when you survive for a long time and you get the extra hp it's pretty correct 40 percent zero crits yeah but how many autos did you really hit there ho you like and he did ult too actually so he should have had 50 percent chance to crit i think on that target group up defend the fire giant I wish I had a little sustain built into this build though. Defend the fire giant. They're probably doing fire, they should be. Oh no, Vulcan's looking for farm like I am. Your left tower is under attack. You can't hit him with an auto, dude. Goodness gracious. Ooh, sneaky sneaky. Oh, gonna get blinked on myself, maybe? Oh, just gonna get TM out, jumped on. He's gonna jump on me. They're all jumping on me. Good triple ults. Vulcan ult down. Come on, Hoagie. You gotta do some damage, buddy. You have to auto. You have to auto them. Well, you can't just auto the air, my guy. You gotta auto them. You wanna try to hit them with those autos. Let's try. All right, I have to play safer because I'm gonna get targeted now. They're realizing my ADC doesn't really do anything. He just kind of throws autos at the air. He's dead. Poor ho you. <laughs> if he says anything about his crates again, uh, we might have to fucking call him out on it a little bit. They're going to gold. We should just go to fire. We play around fire here and get it or just get some kills. We should be good. We need some anti heal. Need some anti heal. Just a little bit. We don't need like massive anti heal. One aura would be pretty solid. One aura item would be nice. He has a ton of magic defense. <clears throat> Can you just AFK under the tower? Uh, well, don't know why he was going to gold with no wards. He also needs wards. Wards. You've got no wards. You've got to place wards down. You will keep dying and be a part of six of our 16 kills if you don't put wards down. Need a little bit of wards, everybody. I'm going to hit 20 here. Uh, and we'll farm out the Bumbus Hammer, like we said. It'll help us survive a little bit more. Plus, we'll be able to spam. I'm missing so many autos now. I was playing really well, and I started trolling. There's level 20, which is great. I'm going to put a deep defensive ward uh, in the fire where it probably won't get counter warded. They're heading over this way. I need a little bit more gold, which sucks. Farming out another 900 gold is going to be kind of difficult. So I'm going to get a ward, too. 36 gold. Oh, you being right is just makes sense. He wants farm. This dude is tanky. Like he's not even tanky, really. I'm gonna get pulled here for sure. Nice. This is bad. There we go. Got one kill. But it was just their support. <clears throat> Discordia is getting picked by the Loki in the back because he's not staying with the team. 
And you can tell he's just been playing scared the whole time. Playing scared doesn't mean survival. It doesn't mean you will live. It doesn't mean you will you will play the game right. You need to understand that when you play video games, there are ways to play the game. If you're letting like your, the emotion of, if you're being scared or letting an actual like regular emotion affect how you move and react in a video game, you really need to just take a step back and realize it's a video game. Messing up's gonna happen, dying's gonna happen. Uh, you're gonna make mistakes, you're gonna miss abilities. So just push yourself to be where you need to be and do what you need to do to actually have fun playing the game. Cause there's no way you've been a part of six of our 17 kills and you're enjoying yourself right now. There's no way, there's no way. And you're, you're just getting picked by this dude over and over again. There's no way. You throw an ability at him. Just so you know, the combo is two and then one, not one and then two. If he had two, he would have rooted him and then he could have hit him with one. He would have killed the Loki there, got a free kill. Got a lot of XP, been really close to 20. Just making the game really hard on yourself, man. Really, really hard on yourself. Don't be afraid to mess up in a video game. It's a video game. It's when you do it on purpose that it's a problem, you know? If you can't help it, then you got to learn so you can help it. All right, we've got our Bumbus Hammer online. I don't know how much use it's going to be, honestly, going into these team fights. Oh, team probably shouldn't be up and right, or we shouldn't be up over here, one or the other. I don't know where they're going to go. Going to zoom, zoom away with my movement speed. Having speed buff, too, on top of the two is pretty nice. We just need to defend. We have a ton of HP right now, too. <laughs> we have 2100 HP on top of a shield that's giving us almost 900 HP. That's crazy. Get this Soul Reaver online and hopefully we can do something with it. Oh, you're so scared. You sh just throw some abilities at him. Don't be shook. Mm, I might play up here. I don't have beads. But if Vulcans and right, we're fine. The Vulcan being me and the Vulcan getting in these fights is super awkward because it shouldn't be possible. We should have a better front line. And it's not that our, our front line's bad. What are they doing? Retreat. Retreat. Nice. Actually, huge kill. That's crazy. I can't believe they just got picked like that. Saving my abilities as much as possible to go in this Loki when he goes for me. Oh my gosh. Okay, I need Spectral. We're cutting a little bit, but I think there's Loki's around. Oh, there's Loki. <laughs> yeah, we definitely need a Spectral for this guy. We're going to go Spectral. We're not going to go into Soul Reaver like we talked about for a second. We should still have more than enough damage to kill them. We'll be crazy tanky as well. This Loki's able to pick up kills for free right now. It sucks. Unfortunate. Oh, it sucks. Hopefully we don't lose off of this. They have a lot of towers to get, but they might be able to end the game. The crit, I don't even know what he hit me for, but it was just a Hydra's crit proc. Can't be greedy. Gotta go spectral is what it is. Game might not be over. I'm not 100% yet. The only thing that's weird there is we got a nice pick on the Vulcan and it seemed like we were going to keep aggressing, but then they called retreat, which was weird. Like they didn't call retreat for me. They told me to retreat afterwards. So I don't know why they backed off. That fight's pretty free. Uh, Cause if, I, if they keep fighting, I rotate too. Oh, that's game. GG. That sucks. Crit Loki still troll no pen too, which is even more wild to me. Like he hit me really, really hard. 1300 damage on auto attacks. Okay. Okay. Oh, we might actually defend this. Nice. Nice. Huge. Is he going for this, the, the Vulcan kill? He might get it. He might not. Yeah, they're going to end. Oh. Oh, kill him. Unfortunate. Nice try. That was a good attempt. Discord ended up getting a couple more kills at the end there. He's just too scared, man. Way too afraid. Push yourselves, guys. When you get in these lanes, even if you're not like used to them, push yourselves a little bit. Don't just sit there and be like, all right, everyone will do everything for me. Move around, try to get some wards out, rotate a little bit. You don't have to be like making plays. You can just, you know, move around a bit and try to be where you need to be at the right time. Uh, but for the love of everything in this universe, start warding, guys. It's so frustrating. Seeing you lose your lanes, get ganked, play bad, and also not war. Not do the bare minimum for your team. It's actually embarrassing. Uh, 
even if you had every ability and do a ton of damage you're still almost like you're borderline a worthless teammate in my book by doing this four wards bro four wards if you have more deaths than wards that's a problem that is not okay that is unacceptable this too i mean just look at their ward you can't see it so their solo has three wards their mid has six eight eleven ten uh versus just me and pretty much just us two warding that sucks i hate that it's a frustrating way because that is it causes you to die a lot it causes you to get ganked over and over again it causes your team to lose the game because you don't ward 100 percent like we had a fat lead that game and then we just threw it down the drain really sad um hopefully you guys enjoyed the video zeus is actually really really fun right now and enjoyable and i'm kind of excited to see if he becomes any a uh, version of a top tier meta mage played in spl hopefully that'd be cool i doubt it but maybe could happen be exciting i'll see how things play out hopefully you like the video i will see you on the video later tomorrow the next day the next day the next day and the next day